going on guys? In this video, I'll be showing you how to do the straddle planche. Let's get right to that. Well, you may be wondering why I'm wearing a hat. Well, so the first progression, it's actually the frog stand. And I showed this in my previous video. So this is what the frog stand looks like. You want to have straight hands. You don't want your elbows bent. Remember that. So, you can take your knee, put it on your elbow, other knee, put it on that elbow. You have to try to balance for as long as you possibly can. This builds up your wrist mobility as well as your shoulder strength. So practice that. No way or form am I an expert in the straddle planche. I just recently got it, so don't judge me and this is how I progress to it. So, the first thing I learned was a tuck planche. And this is how you do that. So you wanna have your hands either facing outwards away from you or you wanna face them backwards or forwards. Anything that's comfortable with you for your wrist position. Hold straight and you tuck your knees as close to your body as you possibly can. You want to have straight elbows. You don't want your elbows bent. Okay, that's how you do that. I'm doing a handstand now and I don't know why. Oh my God. The next thing you want to do is practice the lean. So the straddle planche is highly dependent on how far you can lean because your hands should be in the center of your body. So when you're leaning forward, your hands are basically balancing your entire body. I don't know how this works, but it's physics, bro. When you go into that lane, you wanna kinda of have an arc to your back. You don't wanna have a straight back, you wanna have that arc. So, just gonna lean as far as you possibly can. And when you hold that lane, you wanna to try to hold it for as long as you can. The next progression is the one-legged. You go into that lane, go from tuck to one leg out. And have one leg out, that's gonna build up your shoulder strength, your wrist mobility, and all that good stuff. Next, the last thing is to actually attempt the straddle plunge. So this is the last progression. You go up. I can't hold it for that long, but that's how I progress to it. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. I know that you like it like that. I wait designer, check the name on the tag. White fox fur on my jacket. Excuse me, that's a